Hi, everyone. My name is uh, Dr. Kiran Martin. Um, I'm an Indian pediatrician and the founder and director of a nonprofit called ASHA. ASHA is based in New Delhi in India and works among over 700,000 slum residents in the city. If you want to know more about ASHA, please go to our website, www.asha-india.org. Today, I'm going to speak about uh, one of Asha's uh, values, and this one is called affirmation. According to the Oxford uh, Dictionary, to affirm means to maintain as true. It also stands for giving a person a heightened sense of value through the experience of something emotionally or spiritually uplifting. I'm not talking today about affirming our own selves, but rather about affirming others. At ASHA, we are constantly affirming and appreciating one another in a safe and in a loving environment. However, a declaration of something in a person that is true requires a genuine knowing of the other. This can only happen when we take time to build relationships with one another when we pay attention to each other's strengths and recognize their gifts. We can then speak the truth with conviction and knowledge to what we know about the other. Our affirmation can be authentic and devoid of flattery or manipulation. Every day I see the amazing effects of the practice of affirmation on my team, on hundreds of college students, children, women, and others in our slum communities. Women and girls in the slums are often raised to believe that uh, they have no worth, no value, no identity. They are considered to be a huge burden only to be married off as early as possible. In all my uh, 34 years since I founded ASHA, I have never really seen parents in the slums uh, lovingly affirm their children. Of course, there are complex reasons for that, and I'm not judging them by any means. Why are so many young girls and boys from the Asha slums able to go to prestigious universities? Why are groups of women in the slums so empowered that they can deal with slum lords and other stakeholders? and bring about dramatic changes in their slums? Why do young children flock to the ASHA centers to experience the joy of learning and community service? Affirmation at ASHA is one of the many reasons and an extremely important one. In fact, I would go so far as to say that it is a basic human need, just like food and water. I have seen affirmation work wonders. It brings to life their capabilities, their strengths, their talents, their skills. The effects of affirmation penetrate so deeply that the entire attitude, behavior, and actions of the person are affected. It completely changes the way people experience events and alters the emotional climate of relationships. Words of affirmation leads to courage and a sense of security. They bring out a vibrant expression of the latent potential within us and causes us to flourish in all the dimensions of our lives. You know, people are deeply influenced by those who affirm them and listen to them. Being affirmed does wonders for the other person's sense of hearing. Another thing is that behaviors that are rewarded or celebrated are much more likely to be repeated. I also think that affirmation both in private and in the presence of others is key. This means that we are giving a public honor and respect for a person's gifts and abilities. Now there are some things for which there is absolutely no room. There's no room for judgmental or guilt inducing or condemning or critical words. 
those kinds of words lead to a terrible feeling of rejection. There is no room for loudness or harshness. The tone and manner in which we speak is exceedingly important. How often should we affirm people? It is important that we affirm people on a consistent and regular basis. Did you know that uh, studies have found that consistent affirmation results in the muscles becoming stronger and more active? And on the other hand, our muscles tend to become weak and we feel a sense of fatigue in a negative environment. So let us embrace affirmation as a value to be practiced every day. And let's remember that our affirmations can have a profound impact on the lives of others. The way others experience life's events and relationships around them can change forever. Thank you.